Tis the season for shopping. Today is Small Bus Business Saturday. At Lakeside Plaza, 68 small business owners gather to show off their products and creativity. 3 News Now reporter Isabella Basco shares the story of those fueled by entrepreneurship. At Small Business Saturday here at Lakeside Plaza, business owners are saying that this is not just about dollars and cents, it's really about passion. I get to use my talents and the gifts and abilities that God has blessed me, and I get to bless it, you know, to other people and bring, you know, happiness to them. Even something as small as like an earring. <laughs> Liana Thomas owns Bling Company, where she makes handmade earrings. Her business is the collection of every customer she meets. Every time I have a customer, I always try to ask their name, ask how their day is going. So it really means a lot, like you almost create relationships. For Thomas, it's people <laughs> before profit. I just wanted to use them to bless other people. And that's pretty much like the heart and the reason why I continue to do Blink Co. Despite of my busy schedule, you know, working full time, um, I am a wife and so I have some other roles and responsibilities. Thomas's devotion is an example of why Kayla Connolly helped organize this event to make the load lighter for entrepreneurs. They've got to compete with the bigger businesses, so giving them a space where they can really kind of shine on their own for a day without having to worry about a vendor fee or anything like that was important to us. Connolly maintains people and passion need to stay hand in hand. They were able to make a really cool business out of it, so being able to help them market themselves and get out there so they can keep doing that. It's, an, it's another way to spread joy. It's another way to spread kindness because, like I said, it does take some hard work and time and effort. And when you buy something as small as like an earring, it, you know, that person like makes a little happy dance for sure inside because I sure do. do I sure do that. So in Omaha, Isabella Basco, 3 News Now.